Did you say you're walk. working on your walk? Oh, uh, my model walk. My walk is it's horrible lately, uh, so I have to really work on that. Okay. So, so how do they teach you to work on your walk? Yeah, like I have such like a hockey player kind of walk, so they're trying to teach me how to just loosen up and you know get with the flow. Yeah, because you would, as from hockey, the way your body's built, right, you would go side to side because everything's side to side, pushing exactly. off. So they're trying to teach you to go one in front of the other and be intentional, right? Yeah. yeah. See, did you ever think that years ago these are the things you would be thinking of, like how to relearn to walk? Right? No, and it's so hard. Like, I didn't, it's frustrating, but I'm going to really work on this. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think modeling, is there, do you see any similarities between hockey and modeling? Any at all? Um, maybe just being tough, like, you have to be tough, you know? And, so yeah, like, just being, like, really strong, that's probably the only thing, I'd say. The only thing, yeah. Well, I'm glad we were able to make it work. I know that you've got things you've got to do. So, one of the things that we said we were going to do here is... I wanted to promote your story. Your story was supposed to air last night on ET Canada, yeah. but Britney Spears bumped you. There was a new story about Britney, so William got bumped by Britney Spears. Come on. I know. Can you imagine? So, <laughs> so now your story airs tomorrow night because I got a lot of emails and texts and DMs about you. So you, there you go, guys. The story airs tomorrow. Um. I think what a lot of people want to know, um, what is your plan right now? Are you planning on staying in Canada or are you, you know, there's people saying, come to New York, come to Los Angeles, come to Dallas. Oh, thanks. Where, where do you want to go? I want to, personally, I want to go to New York. I think New York would be unreal. Um, but like, I want to go to Milan. I want to go everywhere. I want to travel the world. So now that modeling can help me maybe do that one day, it's pretty awesome. That's amazing. So would you want a home base still here in Ontario and then also in New York or just kind of everywhere? That's a good idea. Home base here, maybe a cottage, and then my normal house, maybe New York. Yeah, that'd be sick. Nice. So I heard Barry Manilow reached out. Tell us that story. What happened? Yeah, that was huge. Um, it was just because my video Mandy was blowing up and he ended up just posting both my videos that I posted on his Instagram and his Facebook, I think. So yeah, he's being a huge supporter and now I think he got TikTok himself, so I motivated him to do something, so that's cool. <laughs> Amazing. You motivated Barry Manilow to get on TikTok. I mean, TikTok Canada needs to say thank you very much to that. <laughs> Literally, literally. That's, that's amazing. So who else would you like to collaborate with? I know we spoke about that one time a little bit, but who would you like to collaborate with in the next little while? First one that comes to mind, uh, I want to collaborate with Justin Bieber. Either put me in a video or let's meet up one day, figure something out. But yeah, he's a huge role model, so that'd be sweet. sweet. Yeah, so you would want to be in a music video maybe? Yeah. Yeah, maybe like music video, or maybe we just become friends one day, you know, we're buddies. <laughs> you never know, you never can tell. Yeah. Speaking of buddies, everybody has a very big connection with you, and uh, I got a lot of questions, so I'm going to throw a couple your way, we can do like a rapid fire, because I know you've got to get back to work. All right, does this ever get overwhelming for you? That's what someone wanted to know. Yeah, it does, for sure. And it is overwhelming, but my family has really helped me, like, stay grounded. So, and I'm just working on it every day to keep being grounded and not be too overwhelmed with everything going on. Just remember, you know, I'm still a normal human being, and I'm just, this is just a good opportunity that's came up. So I'm just trying to, um, just trying to, yeah, stay humble, but I do want to somehow, some, I want to get somewhere with this, right? So I also do have to be a little overwhelmed, put some pressure on me. But yeah, just have fun with it. And yeah, I, just, I Absolutely. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, there's going to be ebbs and flows with it, right? As, in, as there is in any job, right? Yeah. Um, will you stay in Canada? You kind of already 
answered that. Someone wants to know, will you create a sign for your TikTok followers so that when you're super famous and you're on a red carpet, they'll know that you're giving a signal to them? Ooh, yeah. So I think that's going to be... I see a lot of my fans commenting uh, a high heel emoji under my page. It's like all the moms coming together. So that could be like maybe like a high heel. And in my lives, they always send me this gift and it's a high heel, it's sparkly. So it's like, and I like that high heel. I'm like, that's, I'm gonna buy that for my girlfriend one day. So yeah, I think that could be like a symbol, you know, high heels. There you go. Someone wants to know, would you date someone off of TikTok? Thank. Would you date someone off of TikTok? Someone asked. Okay, um, yeah, I would. Um, I'm not going to say who, but I would. Oh, you have someone in mind already? Yeah, there's one girl in mind a little bit that's beautiful, and I would, but like, yeah, we'll see. Future. Okay, all right, we'll leave that to your private, that's your private life. Um, so that was the next question, do you have a TikTok crush? So I think you already answered that. Um, what's your favorite color, someone said? Uh, green, because my eyes are green. All right. Um, let's see. Hold on. We did that one the other day. Someone says, Tammy says, she just wanted you to know that you bring so much joy to her family. She's 30 and her mother's 51 and her grandma's 59 and we can't get enough. You've touched all three generations of our family. What does that mean to you? That means so much. Like, almost unsubscribable how much that means to me. And, yeah, like, a lot of people say, well, you don't have your own age group. But, like, I have, like, like just to have that age group, the older generation, and, you know, they pass it down to their kids, and, you know, they know what's going on, so... Yeah, that means so much to me. And to have all generations, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and then the last one was, what's one of your favorite things to do when you're not working? I like to play video games. I like to play basketball. I like to work out. And I like to go live and make TikToks. Yeah, there you go. All right, well, we did it. We managed to go live. I know you're in the middle of working today, so thanks so much for doing this. Your story will air tomorrow on ET Canada. If it doesn't, I will update everyone, and hopefully no other giant celebrity bumps you off and we have to reschedule. Thank you so much, Cheryl. Thanks for having me. Uh, thank you, buddy. All right, all the best, and keep us updated on, on all your success, for sure. Yep. Yeah. Okay, yeah. take care. Bye, Bye everyone. Yeah. So there you go. We got it in there. We got a few of your questions. Um, it's a busy work day for everybody. So there you go. Learning how to walk as a model. That's what's happening today. Yeah. All right. This has been fun. Uh, we'll do it again. Um, yeah, we'll have to think about who we'll interview next, right? You never know. You guys have had some very good suggestions so far. I will keep taking your suggestions. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, guys. You're so sweet. And now I'm going to go pack up because I need to go see my mom. My mom is uh, my mom's in the hospital, so I need to go uh, my visit time. That now, Right now in COVID times, they only give you certain times that you can go visit. And my time is at 5 o'clock. So I have to head out. Um, yeah, this is all for you guys. You sent me all those messages, and they were lovely and so fun, and I wanted to make this happen for you. I'm kind of new to TikTok. haven't really been on all that long, um, but uh, it's a fun space. So, yeah. Ah, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate all of that. You guys are the sweetest. Okay, mwah, mwah, mwah. we will talk soon, and we'll figure out who to interview next. These are, what are we going to call this? We'll just call this Talk with Cheryl, T-O-K with Cheryl, right? Well, we'll start our own little thing. That's what we'll do. It'll be fun. Um, 
Aw, thank you so much. Kisses back to you guys all around the world. I see you're all from everywhere, so that's so nice. Cool, cool. Okay, yeah, get thinking on who you want to talk to next.